Oh dan. Yeah. Okey doki. I got to get in the bush now. Out the bush. Fuck it now. That way. Straight. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. So, I wasn't going to do a video today, and then I was, and then I wasn't, then I was. And I've decided I was. I'm out with Lewis. Now, some of you probably don't even know who Lewis is. It's been a while since we've had him on the channel. He was on a Ninja 300. It was way, way, way back on the, when we had the, the Duke 125. He had a CBR 125. And he bought the 300 Ninja, and now he's just bought a 2021 Z750, and it is absolutely gorgeous. But he's got to run it in for 250 miles, so he wanted to get out and do some miles. So that's what we're doing. Obviously, the Austin Racing is making a hell of a lot of noise. Yeah, nothing's really changed. I know this is kind of the fl my voice bit then. <laughs> Nothing really changed. This is like the first time we've had the. A vlog with the Austin Racing, so we'll see what the uh, the audio is like talking over it. I'm wearing my excuse me, I'm wearing my old HJC helmet. We just had some food, so I'm absolutely stuffed at a mixed grill. You know how it is. It's uh, it's got to be done. Uh, what else has changed? Not a lot. Some, I put some new brake pads in the back. The double H's that someone recommended. I got to do the front soon as well. Um, yeah, nothing exciting. Nothing exciting at all. Uh, the missus has finally bought some uh, some uh, biking trousers. She actually bought some of those armoured leggings that you can get. I read some reviews and they seem pretty fucking pretty good for what they are. So um, that's what we decided to get in the end. She finds them comfortable. But no, nothing's nothing's changed. It's just another day. Another day in the life of me. So thank you so so much. We finally hit 7k on the YouTubes. So I am gonna do a giveaway. Give a, a giveaway? A giveaway. I'm gonna do a giveaway. Uh, I'm just trying to set it up. Shit's gonna happen. I'm gonna have a first place, a second place, and a third place. First obviously more prizes, second, third, whatever. Um, most likely just going to be in for the UK audience. I'm sorry, it's just some. It just works sometimes, and um, it's hard shipping things at the minute, and they can take forever. And I've tried it, and they just it's just it doesn't work. Um, if I can find another way, then I will. But otherwise, it will just be. Uh, you're gonna go. There's not way anywhere you can go. Okay. Okay. I tried to be nice. Um, I know, was, you could have squeezed your ass in there, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, what was I saying? I've forgotten. Um, yeah, so anyway, yeah, there's going to be a giveaway. They might have some True Tension stuff in there. Obviously I'm being sponsored. I'm not going to get them to give me free. I'm going to be buying everything on my own money. Just to say a thank you to you lot. Um, I'm not sure how I'm going to work it yet, but expect a giveaway at some point. I'm also going to see if I can work with a friend's company. Yeah, see if we can work a, a deal out with him. See if I can help his business out and help you guys out. So it's a, it's, his business is um, the Royal Sweet Mix. Uh, so he does a lot of sweets and stuff. So we can do something like that. But yeah, I'm going to set something up. So expect something coming out soon. Keep an eye on Instagram and things, as I always say. Yeah, I'm going to gaze over this Z750 for a while, I think. This is a nice bike, I have to say. Yeah, this bike is... It's not... We, we had a Z, the Z1000 parked up next to it. And when you park next to a Z1000, one of those, they have such a nicer green, in my opinion. But when it's just on its own, I think it's really nice looking. Ooh, that's a nice Porsche. It is a nice bike. Like... 
that colour scheme is, is, is stunning. And that paint, the fucking black paint on that is so nice. Pop, 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 pop. Ah. Ah, camera. Ooh. In a 20 as well. Downhill 20. Savage. Savage. <laughs> Is this a tractor towing a tractor? Oh, what's, what's the current? What the fuck is this tractor man doing? What the fuck? He didn't give a shit! He didn't give a shit! <laughs> I will find you. And I will kill you. I don't know, I don't know what are you saying? Here's a video topic to talk about. The time I was this close to getting arrested. Now I've been pulled over a few times, I won't lie. Um, I'm not a badass, I ain't no gangster. Um, but there's some things that are questionable and, um, you know, I have almost been caught for some questionable things sometimes. Oh wait, shit, I know where we are. Oh! <laughs> so, I've actually documented this in a video, but the video, the audio was all over the place and it is up, so see if you can find it, but it's not, I never really explained what actually happened, I don't think. So we'll talk about it. So, it was a night ride, out with a few friends. Um, I think he's planning on overtaking here, so I might have to shut up for a little bit, because you ain't going to be able to hear me. He's going for it. As I was saying, if you can still hear me, I'll try and talk a bit louder. Um, that was uh, on a night ride with the three friends. We had an MT07, a 701, uh, the Bandit. I was on my Grom. We had a KTM Duke 125 and a few other bikes. And uh, we were just riding around, you know, as you do, just kind of like this. Uh, and then we decided to go to a trading state to, um, well, practice some wheelies. You know, it's what it is. Um, and we were testing each other's bikes up, going back and down, you know. Uh, just having a bit of fun, just out of the way, nobody was around. There was a caravan, a guy in a caravan, he's still down there. Uh, and we went up to him, and we're like, look, we're going to go up and down, are you, are you okay? We thought it was all sketchy at the time, it was me that knocked on, I think, as well. Um, and we thought he was pissed. And he said, no, no, carry on, I'll watch for a bit. Um, so he did. And we were chilling. And I was on my mate's LC4640, the KTM, which you've seen a video on before. Um, and my mate who was on the Duke was on the Grom. And um, we were flying up and down, doing wheelies. And as we carried on down the, the trading estate, there was a little left-hand corner down to some lanes. And as we were coming up to there, a copper pulled out, we are like, oh shit, I fucking U-turned in front of him. Uh, it was two girls, and I think, apparently, the, the one of the women was uh, one of the officers or something down there, I'm not sure. One of the heads, anyway. Um, and I just fucking U-turned, I gun it back. And I jump off and give him, give uh, my mate's bike back to him. And I look around, expecting my Grom to be there. Uh, my mate had shot off on the, my Grom and ran away. So I was like, oh shit, I haven't got a bike. And obviously they pulled over. And uh, everyone got a bit defensive. Like, we haven't done anything wrong. Because they didn't catch us doing anything wrong. Um, and they're like, look, look. And I just said to everyone, just look, chill. Uh, let them do their checks. We're all legal here. Let them do their checks so we can carry on. And... Um, while they were all doing their checks, I was like, well, what do I say? Because now I haven't got a bike, and there's one bike here that isn't registered to me. So I said I was a passenger on someone else's bike, um, which they believed. Um, 
and everything had chilled out, everything was calm, it was all handy dandy and I thought that was it, I thought that was the end of it and as we were leaving my Grom, that it, what he had actually done is run home <laughs> and locked it in his garage well he turned back round, come back then, thinking they had left and he pulls in, he's like, so whose is this bike? and I go, oh that's my bike he was just test riding it and uh, luckily enough he was, you know, fully comped and was able to test ride bikes because he was on a CVT um, I thought he was gonna, they were going to get me because I was on my A2 so I didn't have L plates on my bike but they didn't, they checked his names he said it was, his bike was the other one that was lying here because we just said he had gone for a piss <laughs> um, but I think there were so many people there they just got confused with who bikes were whose because um, they took my details anyway but as a passenger and then I jumped on the Grom and fucking drove off um, and they followed us for a little bit but as soon as we got to a, a few corners we were gone um, but how I almost got rested basically I was on my mate's KTM when they first checked and I only I think I don't think I was allowed on my insurance to ride other bikes at the time so if they had fully investigated the whole situation I would have been stumped um, plus the bike wasn't restricted and everything else so they could have really got me there um, and obviously wheelies and everything else but yeah it was a a bit of a, a nicky sticky situation it was one of those clench bottles um, and there might have been other stuff going on at the same time but it's not something I can discuss on camera that's for sure um, yeah, it was. Uh, that's the closest I've ever been arrested. I've had to sit in a, a police car before because of my exhaust and my KTM Duke. Um, and he told me to sit in the car. And thinking in my head, I hadn't done anything wrong. I didn't sit in the back of the car. I sat in the passenger seat, and he was not happy with that one. That was right outside my house, so that wasn't recorded. Um, actually, you know, I've been pulled over a few times, and it's all been because of my exhaust. And I don't think it will be the last. Time I get pulled over because I'm exhausted with this bad boy on the back. But yeah, there's a little story for you that I don't think anyone knew about. So this video isn't a waste in the end, so there you go. <laughs> Suck your nan. <laughs> Hello. I need a wee, I need a drink, that needs a drink, huh? Is that what that happened? It's always louder than me. I heard it, I thought it was me. What happened, just got stuck in gear? Your chain is bouncing like mad. That's odd, yeah. Yeah. My gosh, I'm so hot. It's very hot. Uh, Ow. Oh yeah, I just I went round the corner and I went to bounce it, it just got stuck. Hmm. Yeah, I thought we'd run over something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know, I heard the ambulance, so I was trying to dance. Well, right? I couldn't even hear the ambulance.